ABC 10 News starts now. A lawsuit filed today over the death of legendary radio host E. Stephen Collins claims the hospital where he was treated failed him. In a statement, the family says, quote, E was an icon in Philadelphia. We hope to obtain a measure of justice for his family. Collins was rushed by ambulance to Chestnut Hill Hospital in September after a complaint of chest pains. The lawsuit claims that Collins had three abnormal EKGs and died while waiting to be transferred to Presbyterian Hospital. According to the lawsuit, a doctor failed to provide urgent treatment for Collins, who eventually went into cardiac arrest. Uh, he should have been stabilized. He needed to have intervention to undo a blockage and had that occurred correctly and had he been given the correct medications which did not terribly depress his blood pressures he would be alive today we reached out to chestnut hill hospital to get a response to the lawsuit and so far our calls haven't been returned east stephen collins was 58 years old